Let's see. Hello, everybody. Uh, today is day 143. <clears throat> Excuse me. It is October uh, 2nd. And uh, today's uh, the second day that uh, my daughter has been uh, spending the weekend with my ex-wife. So uh, today's been kind of a, an odd day. There are moments where I'm like, where's my daughter? You know, and uh, whatnot. So and I've been checking in with her all day and she's doing real good. So that's good. I'm glad. I'm glad. Um, today, uh, I'm going to see if I can rearrange the room here a little bit. Um, you know, growing up, and uh, I kind of touched a little bit on this yesterday, you know, I had said something about, you know, the, the grocery store had a sale on cosmetics, and I was like, ooh, you know, and I was genuinely excited, you know, and new fingernail polish and, and whatever else, and, you know, growing up, I was always envious of the vanity dresser, okay? My sister had one, my grandma had one, I don't think my mom had one, but you know, it's a dedicated piece of furniture that you can have your makeup on or your, um, you know, things, your hair bands, you know, I have like hair ties and, you know, they're, they're like tribbles, they're everywhere, you know, um, and so what I'm trying to think about is, because I'm thrifty, which is another word to say that I'm cheap. I'm not cheap. I'm thrifty. Um, I'm trying to figure out a cool way to kind of build my own station. Um, I have had a one time like a piece of furniture that kind of, it was called a vanity. But it was like, it was like the dresser back there and a mirror on top of it. You know, to me a vanity is like what you sit down at. And you've got the mirror in front of you, and it's your opportunity to just me. And, um, you know, so anyway, um, I have a number of um, tables uh, from my Warhammer 40K days uh, just lying around. Um, so I'm trying to think of how I can build something or make something. Um, back when I did uh, radio-controlled helicopters and airplanes, I would often build my own, you know, uh, way of storing the drivers or the hex wrenches and all my tools and everything. So there's got to be a way. I mean, I'm not going to put a piece of particle board on the wall and, you know, sort my uh, nail polish on the uh, particle board, although that's a good idea. Um, but, you know, I just want something um, kind of as I am in my uh, second childhood here uh, is what I'm calling it. Um, you know, I, I, I'm, I'm in my second puberty, my second growing up, I'm experimenting, and uh, I want to have my fingernail polish out arranged by color, and I, you know, I'm tired of having my brushes, um, let me grab what I got here, you know, um, I have all my makeup and whatnot, like in a tinkle box, you know. Um, which is cool because like before if I needed to put it away, I put it away, slide it under my bed. Nobody would know what it was. Not that I was hiding. But it was convenient and now it's like, but I want that, you know, I don't know. I don't know. Like I said, I'm having my second childhood, uh, puberty, whatever you want to call it, adolescence, condensed. And uh, I'm not saying I want a poster bed with the canopy and the frills on it, although that would be cool too. But, um, you know, again, I'm seeing what I can do. It occupies my mind as well as, you know, keeps me focused. Something functional. Uh, I had a thought too, again, back from my, my hobby days, I have a number of these like tackle boxes and I don't know, maybe I could cut the top off and put the bottles in. I don't know, I'm thinking. I'm thinking. I'm thinking. I got a brain. Um, it was funny, yesterday, um, you know, I used to do um, technical theater stuff once upon a time. And so I'm kind of, I was a deck electrician, okay. Uh, I'm not unaware of how to set up electrical devices. Let me put it to you that way. So as I was doing my, uh, I was setting back up the uh, amplifier and speakers in my yesterday, I'm like, 
Um, you know, I'm not afraid to <laughs> get a pair of wire clippers and, and rewire and set up my speakers and whatnot. So it's like, again, I was just kind of like, you know, I am building the world that I want. I am building the house that I want around me. I am, um, you know, it's, it's not an aggressive thing as much of just, you know, if you have, I have time and opportunity, um, you know, I can make my, you know, granted you could say, well, you're, well, duh, you're uh, 45, 46 years old. You can do what you want to do around your house. Um, but I'm just kind of being creative and looking at things and going, how can I, how can I improve this? How can I make it easier for me? And uh, we'll see. So anyway, uh, that is the deal. There is a um, kind of a fundraiser later in town at uh, one of the local bar and grills for our um, Trans Woman National, and I might go to that. Uh, number one, to get me out of the house and in the public and talking to people, which would be good for my voice. Um, at the same time, it's pretty darn nice to do nothing. Um, my grandparents used to do nothing, and I used to make fun of them in a way. My grandfather, I love my grandfather, um, who's long since passed. But, you know, I used to sit there and go, why does he go sit outside and, would you know, do nothing? And, uh, you know, I guess nowadays you would consider it to be, you know, kind of a very zenny, you know, um, I'm in one with the environment or whatnot, but just relax. And um, I don't know. I don't know. Maybe this is more of a comment on our society, but, you know, I, I feel the pressure to be on the go and to do this and to do that. And, um, you know, I'm, I'm not bored. Um, you know, I don't want to be stressed out. I don't want to be, you know... And also, too, uh, you know, when you have some free time and you're not responsible for anybody for the immediate moment, it's nice to go and let your hair down. So we'll see. Anyway, that's it for today. So bye. Good luck. And we will see you later. Bye bye.